Hello and welcome to my presentation. My name is Dr. Mohamed Sirli, an associate professor at the American University in Cairo. The paper's title is An IoT-Based Reconfigurable Micropump for Drug Delivery Applications. This is an outline of the system. The main idea is to build a wearable micropumping device that is integrated with sensors and integrated with IoT to remotely monitor the specific vital signs and remotely activate and reconfigure the micropumping system to release the correct. Our IoT module works as shown in the diagram. Our microcontroller sends the data to a flashed Wi-Fi module which publishes these data on the cloud. Once they are on the cloud, our phone app will view our visualizations to the physician. The physician would want to choose the drug configuration mode, which will set the injection dose and frequency for each drug. This is done through the phone app, and the app also publishes these choices to the cloud, while the Wi-Fi module would read these data from the cloud and send it back to the microcontroller to send the signal to activate the pump. We could use several drugs in the package and each one of them could be controlled um, separately. A memory alloy based smart micro pumping system that was developed. The pump doesn't have moving parts and it actuates through shape memory alloy wire phase transformation which deflects a polymeric compliant capsule, thus injecting the drug with the desired dosage. We have integrated the pump with the IoT module and developed a smartphone app to control the and reconfigure the pump wirelessly. We use the system for in vitro delivery of cancer therapeutics, and with the correct bolus regime, we could achieve more than 71% cytotoxicity. With further dose optimization, we can achieve close to 100% cytotoxicity. Our outlook of the system is now focused on integrating machine learning and artificial intelligence modules to automatically predict the correct therapeutic dosage and personalize the treatment of cancer patients. Thank you for listening. For any questions, please feel free to email me.